strikes again! Here it comes! I got your back! Here you go. Let's go! The decreed hour is come. Set forth with my blessing, Prince Noctis. Thank you, your majesty. Take your leave and go in the grace of the gods. Right. <sighs> Well, princes will be princes. So much for royal protocol. Not like you had to deliver a formal address. Your Highness! What now? I fear I have left too much unsaid. You place a great burden on those who would bear with you. <laughs> You're one to talk. I ask not that you guide my wayward son, merely that you remain at his side. Indeed, Your Grace. We'll see the prince to Altissia if it's the last thing we see. Yeah, what he said. Hate to break this up, but Kor's got the motor running. Drados, he's in your hands. And another thing. Do mind your manners around your charming bride-to-be. Your Majesty as well. Try to mind yours around our esteemed guests from Niflheim. You have no cause for concern. Nor do you. Take heed. Once you set forth, you cannot turn back. You think I would? I need only know that you are ready to leave home behind. Don't know about you, but I'm ready as I'll ever be. Take care on the long road. Wheresoever you should go, the line of Lucis goes with you. Walk tall, my son. I think we can forget about hitching our way there. Thought people were friendly outside the city. Yeah, you can only go so far on the kindness of strangers. You're just gonna have to push her all the way. I've already pushed myself... to the brink of death. Get up. Come on, car isn't gonna move itself. Sheesh. Uh, I thought the car was supposed to move us. Wouldn't that be nice? Can it? Ready? Steady? Uh -huh. Push! Uh -huh. <clears throat> 
Unbelievable. Not exactly a fairy tale beginning, huh, Prince Noctis? We let ourselves get carried away. Look, these things happen. Let's just hope this isn't some omen. Gladio, do me a favor. What? Push this thing by yourself. All by myself? You won't even notice if we just let go. Prompto, don't even think about it. Save some breath for pushing. Ignis, come on, time to switch. Nah, -uh. we just switched back there. And it's my turn, Nucked. His turn. Oh, my hands are killing me. You rather I kill you with mine? Easy there, tough guy. Any luck? Only a busy signal. Oh, hold the phone. Is it just me? Or was it supposed to be way closer? I assure you, the map is correct. The map said Hammerhead was right there. Literally next door. Looks that way. On a map of the world. <sighs> the world's a big old place, filled with wonders. Uh, tell that to my legs. You guys even pushing? Hard as I can. With everything I've got, we'll be there in no time. Hey there, y'all kept a girl waiting. Now, which one's the prince? Aha! Hello, your highness. Congrats on your wedding. Not hitch just yet. Lady Luna Freya's groom-to-be, here in Hammerhead. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies for Papa. Well, that makes you... Cindy. Sid's grease monkey granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still young. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom classic, not some beat up old clunker. Prince Noctis. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of him. What? You got a long way to go, son. And that slack jaw's getting you nowhere fast. She's gonna take a while. Y'all get her in and run along. <sighs> Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Now, we play the waiting game. Uh, never liked that game. Never any good at it, either. <laughs> y'all ain't never been out this way before, have you? Go on, have a look around. This'll make sure y'all don't get lost. Well, might as well make good use of the extra time. Take a look at our wares. A moment, knocked. We've expended the last of our funds on the repairs. I suggest we confer with Cindy. Broken down and flat broke. 
Adding insult to injury. Old man's in for both after charging us that much. Yeah, let's pay him a visit. They've got everything here. Thank you kindly. Oh. You see this, Nacht? What about it? Check it out. What is it? <laughs> There's more dangerous things prowling about these days. Nothing but junk food. Oh, oh, I mean, uh, welcome. I can tell you all about the area. So what'll it be today? Wanna help out with some varmints? Looks perfectly comfortable from where I stand. Not in that color, it doesn't. Want to grab some ingredients? Sure. Ignis could make use of them. Let's say that. On my way.
I say we take a break. It works for me. She ain't gonna be ready for a while. Y'all need something? We're strapped for cash. Any way we could earn a little? Oh, now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some ornery varmints that have been causing a ruckus around here. I'd be happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? Old man's got his eye on you, Noct. Show him what you got. But don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to rip y'all to shreds. Here, this ought to be enough for a place to stay. Just between us, though, don't tell Papa. Make tracks. Ignis, we're going. On my way. <laughs> Looks like we found. First targets. Ready, knocked. Hide it! Yeah. <laughs> Gotta lose a game drop. Disposal. Use them. Yeah. Ignis! Uh -oh. Yeah! Let's be done with this ripper. Never miss! Done in a minute. Time to spin. Yeah. Woo! We got some real chemistry here. Ha! Brilliant. No big deal. Excellent work. On we go. <sighs> what happened here? A telegraph pole's been split in two. And not just this one either. The hell do you think did this? Hard to say. Natural disaster, perhaps? You sure? A hammerhead doesn't have a scratch on it. Maybe a huge monster came and knocked him down. It better not be the varmint Cindy was talking about. Ugh. They aren't gonna know what hit him. Let's do this. Best offense is a good defense. Impressive. Yep. Not the time for horseplay. Didn't mean to do that. Keep it together. Gladio! Don't miss. Problems? 
Nothing uh, warranting royal attention. Ah, I'll play it by ear. Alright! We'll be done in no time. Let's get on with it. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the paths are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Yeah. We are both, before you know it, <clears throat> lover boys hitched. Wait for car repairs, then wedding bells in the air. Got it. Yeah. Almost there. Give it your all. Strike to catch him off guard. Don't wear yourself out like that. Take cover <laughs> and rest up. Take a look. So, what did Cindy say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. <laughs> Not missing. He said he's holed up in that shack. this knocked get out of here you okay we are now spoke too soon Onward. Yep. Hey, what about the shack over there? This creature is known as a saber tusk. It skewers prey with its tusks, extracting game from the safety and comfort of burrows. That's a bit heartless. Don't mention it. Rules. Oh yeah. Hey, who's out there? Well, and look who's in here. The man of the hour. Dave, right? Been looking for you. Didn't mean to cause y'all any trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. 
I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Sure, we'll do it. Well, for the right price. Well, Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw him. Phew. For a second I thought you were gonna forget to ask for cash. <laughs> I've been hunting for years, but I ain't never seen dual horns with blood red tusks locked up. Wise to rest up before we set out. In that case, let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out in full force around here, huh? So they're the new Crown's Guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh, is it cool that we rock Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made him especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So wear it with pride. We're here. Let's call it a day. All right. I'm gonna pitch the tent. Perfect timing. <laughs> like a father to her. Ever since they got back, Sid's been the only one looking after her. Rather more than a middle <laughs> All things considered, I'd say she turned out okay. Not like any girl, you just need to treat her right. Treat her wrong and Sid will stop his right the sun don't shine. Take care of the car and it will take care of us. Yeah, the car. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever sit inside that beautiful car again. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Napping was even better. Over there! That's it, right? Huh. That's a dual horn? Yes, but not your run-of-the-mill breed. We'd best make quick work of it. <laughs> Wait a sec. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be, too. Things vicious. You sure? 
Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! <laughs> nice one. It's not over yet. <laughs> Ready for round two. Huh? Bring it. Marco, you're up. Nice one, Prompto. It's nothing. Take this! Ignis! Of course. Prompto! Nice one, Prompto. Or what? I'll give you that. Ring, ring. Hello? Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Ken. Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. So, who's up next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Because I need the legroom in back. Feels so sluggish. Indeed. It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. Uh, uh, what is that? A live hurricane. That thing's like half bird, half storm, half airship. You realize that's three halves. Well, it explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. It's only so far a man can walk. Our Crown City upbringing didn't prepare us for this. Ugh. Pretend you're walking to the car. Huh? Hey! 
keep it moving. Mm hmm Right behind you. Sure, Ignis could make use of them. Sorry about the wait. Ain't she pretty? She's almost too pretty for the road. She's back. We should all get a picture with her. All the more reason to ride with care. Oh, and before I forget, would y'all mind making a little delivery for me? No, not at all. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that'd be swell. Grandpa like grandkid. Now that she's all polished up and ready for the road, would you care to take her for a little test drive, Noct? Sure. Why not? And I needn't remind you to exercise caution. What's the forecast? Clear skies, with the temperature rising. Nice. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but... Once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. Everybody out. <sighs> Do we have to walk? Time to go. Mm -hmm.
Everything in order? Yep. All right. for a minute. Yeah, my throat's bone dry. Sounds like grounds for a pit stop. Sounds like a waste of time and money. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? Have yourselves a good browse. Much appreciated. Please come again. And uh, noteworthy news? Huh? Time to go. Mm-hmm. Everybody out. Should be a nice change of pace. I say we take a break. Sounds reasonable enough. Oh, while well, I got gotcha. you. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. What are y'all at? What coat do you fancy? Go on, pick a color. Anything in mind for the interior? How do you want the wheels? What do you fix in to upgrade? How's this? Y'all just sit tight now. Well, here she is, just like you ordered. <clears throat> we 
Well, ain't you a lucky one? I've got just the thing. She's a right mess. Well, just leave her to me. Y'all just leave her to me. And this goes there. <sighs> there. <sighs> Good as new. Another day. Hey, what are you after this time? I'll see you later. Time to go. All right. Well, I'd say that's far enough for today. Might be wise to leave the driving to me until we found our bearings out here. Y'all came all the way out here to deliver the... Hmm? Uh, Umbra. Bringing us stuff. Atta boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure, that's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden.